We're at Terry's gym today with Colin Moeller. And uh, Colin and I have been uh, bodybuilding at this gym for about five years. Colin's moved on to some other things. Colin, uh, how old are you? I'm 19 years old. And you've got a pretty important championship under your belt. What is that? Well, back when I was 18, I went down in California and competed in the IMBA. Wait, which what's is the, the IMBA? It's the International Bodybuild, Natural Bodybuilding Association. Mm -hmm. And I competed in the team class and won the overall team world championships for that. Wow. I'm sitting with a world champion. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Well, I've known you for a few years. So you're 19. Mm -hmm. And uh, you've been working out since, uh, since when? I was about 13 when I started seriously training. Mm -hmm. I've been in weightlifting for a long time with my father, but seriously learning the art of bodybuilding since I was about 13. Mm -hmm. now, now, of all the different sports, why did you choose bodybuilding? Well, bodybuilding, it's for yourself. It's mm -hmm. all one-on-one, -on -one, yourself, not a team or anything, and it teaches you a lot of responsibility. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, just a determination alone for it. It's mm -hmm. very hardcore and it's really fulfilling. Mm -hmm. So what have been some of the benefits? How has it affected you uh, over the past, what, six years? For me, it's taught me a lot of responsibility to um, really train hard and better myself in life. Um, helped me a lot during high school and middle school. Mm -hmm. um, I had anger issues, but coming up here and working with Terry a lot, he really held me accountable for what I was doing and taught me um, meanings of life, really, mm -hmm. and really mm -hmm. pushed me hard and taught me how to become a man, really. So through bodybuilding, Terry kind of taught you uh, oh, yeah. life, I mean, life skills. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've been up here for a long time and he yeah, <laughs> pushes you hard mm -hmm. and really teaches you a lot. So you've, uh, you've been all over the country competing. You're, you're an international champion and uh, you've worked out at some other gyms. Mm -hmm. Reflecting back, how do you reflect on Terry's training? Well, for Terry's training is, it's, like I said, it's hardcore. Mm -hmm. You know, he's a really great teacher. I mean, depending on what you want to work on. And for myself, um, I want to become a bodybuilder. And that's mm -hmm. what Terry did. And, uh, you know, he'll really teach you the basics of, I mean, bod your body. I mean, nutrition, training, everything. Mm -hmm. He used to have me come up here and he would make me take tests. And if I didn't get a lot of things correct, he'd make me pay for it. <laughs> but um, compared to other gyms, it's... The other gyms are a lot more clubs. They're mm -hmm. not gyms. They're athletic clubs, really pretty walls, this and that. And um, it's more of a social gathering. Yeah. Here, when you come here, you're expected to train, get your training in. And if not, Terry will get you out of here. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> but, I noticed that. We don't do any talking until after the training is no, over. No, no. Yeah. But he's a great guy. He really pushes you hard. Mm -hmm. He knows how to have mm -hmm. fun with it, make you enjoy it and mm -hmm. love it. Mm -hmm. It's the best mm -hmm. part. Mm -hmm. So. My next question was, as a trainer, you know, what are Terry's, you know, best attributes? Of course, he's he's an accomplished not only trainer, but he's been competing for 50 years and still winning championships, and mm -hmm. that's fantastic at his age. Some of his best attributes, I would say, is the um, knowledge to be able to work with anybody. Mm -hmm. um, he's very calm if he needs to be, and really teach you the in and outs of things. Mm -hmm. um, and he's just a great person. You know, he really. Um, gets to know the person, it's not just a trainer on trainer, mm -hmm. it's more of a friendship. And uh, that's what I like the best about him training. And he knows every inside and out of training. Mm -hmm. You know, you, bodybuilding, yeah. powerlifting, mm -hmm. I mean, how to lose weight, you know, any, every type of thing. You had mentioned earlier that uh, Terry uh, is, understands real well and is able to teach mm -hmm. the concept of, you know, focusing on just that one oh, muscle you're- Mind the muscle connection. That. Yeah, talk about that. With um, bodybuilding or any weightlifting in general, the whole thing is to, make a certain muscle react and mm -hmm. work that. And I know over times we'd be doing leg press and or leg extensions mm -hmm. and uh, I'd be feeling it in my knees. He's like, all right, now think. Focus on the upper quads and really think. Don't move your legs at all and work the pain up into your upper thigh. And that's the mind the muscle connection. Mm -hmm. And I could never get it, never get it. And now I'm starting to learn it. Mm -hmm. And it takes years to experience. The first time ever he ever told me about that, I put my hand around his thigh and you can feel just the vibrations and electricity through the leg. Mm -hmm. And that's what the mind and muscle connection is. Mm -hmm. That's what creates growth and uh, more um, muscle maturity. Yeah, no, I remember when I first started, I, my body was always looking for the easy way to do the exercises. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if it's easy, you're not doing it right. Yeah. That's what Terry would always say. Mm -hmm. um, if it's hard and it hurts more, that's the right way. Yeah. I keep doing that. <laughs> Well, we're so lucky that you just happened to uh, drop in today from Bend. Colin, 
We, uh, we wish you the best of success in your future competitions. Thank you. God bless you.